Good morning, guys. I hope you all had a great weekend. Yeah, what have I been up to? On Saturday, I went up to Lisco to help out uh, Rob Knight from the Lisco Four Wheel Drive Club and the Responsible Technical Driving Four Wheel Drive Club to um, put up a couple of signs for the New South Wales Four Wheel Drive Association um, at the Spanish Steps actually because uh, yeah the Spanish Steps are really still open because of an agreement between the association and State Forest so yeah Rob Knight organized that signs and I um, yeah offered to help him out there at the same time obviously we quickly drove the Spanish Steps Rob Knight had his old 40 series with him yeah quite amazing where that car goes it really hasn't anything done to it except uh, front and rear locker um, yeah after that we drove pipeline um, that was good in the evening we had a barbecue and uh, the Sunday which will be the next video then we had a club trip for responsible technical for wheel driving uh, to drive up uh, Janolan Trick which also was a pretty good trip but that is not this video so I hope you enjoy and see you guys before I caught up with Rob in the morning I just had a little play at the wombat holes Before hanging the signs up, we went to an escarpment overlooking the Wolgan Valley and I had the chance to send the Mavic up for a little flight. Even at this not so well known location, Rob managed to collect a full bag of rubbish, which is really a pity. Very good. Tread lightly and leave no trace. Yes. Alright. We weren't planning to film the Spanish Steps as we have done it so many times. But given that we were only two cars, uh, we got the drone out and uh, that's a bit different perspective of the Spanish Steps I guess. After our quick little drive uh, up the Spanish Steps, we now getting back to work, putting the sign up at the other end of the Spanish Steps. I think Robert is going a bit overboard now, painting. Yeah. No, you're painting your pants. Yeah. What's the point of that, Robert? Oh, it's it doesn't rust. <laughs> That's all the rubbish we collected, or Robert collected. I've got some more in my bag. Yeah, alright, stop. No? No different sizes. No? No? Is there an old one? There's yeah, an old one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good work. There you go. On our way back home, we decided to make a quick detour and drive the old drift road, um, also known as Pipeline.
block got stuck here um, very close to a piece of pipeline sticking out on the right hand side and he didn't want to bend his panels so he reversed a little bit back and after a bit of rock packing and so on he managed to drive out there without an issue and then it was my turn to drive a uh, pipeline which uh, yeah did not prove to be too much of an issue unfortunately people who couldn't drive the track and couldn't be bothered to winch uh, cut out uh, a meter one and a half to the right hand side on one of the rock steps which yeah uh, first of all widens the track again which is not good but also makes it far less interesting um, yeah usually if we can if we can't drive any of that stuff we just get the winch out and uh, winch it up Thanks for watching guys, uh, please keep in mind if you enjoyed the video please share and like, it will help us to make more videos and uh, keep you supplied with good 4 wheel drive footage.